Hi, kindergarten students. It's Mrs. Hawkins again. Hey, listen. Peanut woke up in the middle of the night and recorded a video for you doing the letter sound. I couldn't believe it when I woke up. He hasn't said a word since, though, so I'm not sure where he's learning how to talk so well. Anyway, he's going to have you practice the video this week with the letter sounds. And I'm going to show you how we want you to practice it, OK? So when you find the little picture of Peanut, it'll just be him doing the letter sounds and practicing. But I'm going to show you what we want to see. We want you to practice every day. And we also, you'll need to get your um, picture of the alphabet out, your um, letters of the alphabet out, so that you can follow along with the song, with the sounds, OK? And then I'm going to be actually looking up at the top. You'll see my eyes moving. But keep your eye on Peanut for the sounds, OK? And I'll be doing the sound motion. Whenever you do the alphabet, we want you to make sure that you use the motions that Coach Ella has been teaching you when you use your phonics, because that's how it's going to stay in your brain forever. OK, here we go. Hi kids, it's Peanut in the classroom again. I wanted to go over our letter sounds this week and I want you to practice these every single day. And if you feel like it, you can even practice them a couple of times a day. I love teaching kids how to read. So the first part of reading is learning your letter sounds so that you don't even have to think about them. So make sure you do your zoophonics hand motions along with the sounds as we go through the alphabet. You can have a copy of the alphabet in front of you so that you can keep track of where we are. Ready? Let's go. Ah, b, k, d, e, f, g, ha, i, j, k, l, m, m, a, Great job. Keep practicing every day. If you get really good at it, do it on the Padlet for the week. <laughs> 